Hi, welcome to a special Tom's Take with my good friend, fraternity brother. I call him KB. I still see KB on the back of his beer mug over there at uh, 604 South State Street. But to most people who obviously appreciate what he does for a living, he's Dr. Kevin Byer, gastroenterologist. What a fitting time, KB, Dr. Kevin Byer, to have you on March 1st is the first day of National Colorectal Cancer Awareness Month. That's correct. How important is that to you? What does that mean to you? You've been saving lives, not to embarrass you, but that's just reality. That's correct. For but 35 years. That mug at the Beta House was an iced tea mug, not a beer <laughs> mug. No, man, it was beer. Here's but, Brother KB, Brother KB. I remember. I, I built a career, Tommy. Yes. 35 years battling this disease. So it's extremely and, important. And you it, call that disease wicked. It's terrible. You've used it's that awful. term wicked. It is. And it, it happens. It's, it's, it's one in 25 people are going to get it. That's the incidence. Wow. 4% of adult population. I've heard wow. 150,000 in the past year. That's They're predicting that this year. Or that was 2021. Yeah. It's going to be yeah. another 150,000. 50,000 people are going to die. Wow. And it's the second leading cause of, uh, colon, or of cancer death in the United States every year. So it's extremely important. Yeah, my, well, being brought up, my father always taught me control the controllables. Now, some aspects of colorectal cancer you can't control, but there is a thing called preventative and yep. early di diagnosis and things like that. That's what that's what we can hope for to, to fight the, the beast. The Absolutely. Wicked beast. Screening. Screen. Screening okay. is key. Now, I want to ask you, KB, so, I, you know, with uh, Jamie Samuelson, a, a you know, well-known sports uh, personality 97 one died tragically at 45 years old and so everybody was thinking to, should the diagnostic should you take the, the test the screening should we move that up to 45 or is that just was that just a very unique it, situation? that's a debate but it, it, 50 used to be the, the the magic age right it's trending toward 45 it's not completely there yet there's a lot of debate and, and discussion about it but it's moving closer to 45 the younger people are, are still the exceptions Right. It's still a disease of 50 and over as majority of the patients are going to get colon cancer. But it's important to get screened. This is preventable. Okay. So define screen. What that is. Is there is there more than is there, I mean we've done the, you know, the colonoscopy. Well, that's uh, the gold standard. Yeah, that's that what, is that, the gold standard. That, is there that anything is, else you can do besides there, that? There are some non-invasive tests, some some stool tests that tech check for DNA of of uh, polyps and tumors. Okay. Not quite as accurate as colonoscopy. That's okay. Still, that's still the gold standard. That's surefire. That, that's, okay. That, that doesn't miss. I'll say. I've had three of them. Our cameraman Woody has had three of them. Last four week. Of them. Yeah, last week. Last four week was the four. fourth. Last week four. was the fourth. Okay. And Brother Woody. I, I performed 10 of them today on patients. So, I mean. Wow, you're down usually you're 15 a day. Yeah, it's a little slow right now. <laughs> COVID. <laughs> okay. <laughs> it's COVID. So, it's always the prep. It's like whenever my wife's taking me to these three colonoscopies, on the, on the drive there, because you get driven there, because um, you're not going to drive back, right. I, feel, I always say, well, the tough part's over with. <laughs> you know, I was up all night, did the prep, and now it's easy peasy, right? right. Isn't that basically right. it? Prep is the tough part. Yeah. Tell every patient. Yeah. Yeah. It's, it's just a, like a bad night with a flu or a bad night, a t night of Taco Bob's. Yeah, okay. Yeah. But it beats the alternative, right, KB? Absolutely. Yeah. Get that over the with, then you can just take a nap. That 100%. So we're going to challenge our fraternity brothers and everybody. We're going to put, we're going to send this video to everybody we know. And what's the message behind that, KB, that you want to send beyond, behind the video? Get screened. Get your rear end in and get screened. <laughs> <Literally. laughs> this disease happens. Yeah. Right? I'll, I'll throw a few names out there. Okay. You probably have people that have maybe impacted your life with colon cancer that you know. Right. Here's some that we all know. Vince Lombardi. Yeah. Died of colon cancer. Yeah. Jackie Gleason. Okay. Oh, Audrey wow. Hepburn. Wow. Elizabeth, Mon Elizabeth Montgomery. Wow. Charles Schultz. Oh, my. Tom Lehman had it at 36, the pro golfer. Yeah. He was, he was cured. Yeah. Same with Daryl Strawberry. So, I mean, it's a common, it's a disease that affects everybody. But more importantly for me, my father-in-law died of colon cancer. Wow. At age 51. 51, man, he barely I made met, the screening. 10 days before I met my lovely wife, Mary. So I never met him. Oh, my. And this oh disease my. robbed my kids of knowing the grandfather. Yeah. So, so I'm passionate about it. It hits home. This is a key key part of health maintenance. 
He's my Do man. It. He's Do KB. It. Do Dr. It. Kevin Byer. Do it. Tom's take. I appreciate being on. Dr. Byer gets screened. Thanks, Tommy.